Here's problem 33. It says given parallelogram QRST, QRST, and they give us the links. It says what value of this X is going to prove that parallel parallelogram is a rhombus? Now remember, a rhombus, what's special about a rhombus? Well, the main thing is a rhombus, all sides are exact same length. So basically, we need, if it's going to be a rhombus, I need this side QR, which is represented by 6X minus 5, to equal this side RS that's represented by 4X plus 13. So all I'm going to do is take 6x minus, oop, minus 5, not 15, is equal to 4x plus 13, solve for x, and then boom, put it right in the box. Well, if I subtract 4x from both sides, I'm going to get 2x minus 5 equals 13. And now I add 5 to both sides, 2x equals 18. When I divide by 2, I can easily see x needs to be 9. So I'm going to put 9 in the box. When I put 9 in there, it'll make all the sides, at least this side and this side, the exact same. And that'll help it be a rhombus.